Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use animation keyframe for text in Filmora 11. So you know that we have Filmora 11.7 and Wondershare just changed something. They changed the way how animation keyframe for text work and now we cannot click at the preview window and change the text and to add keyframe. Okay, so I'm going to make a new tutorial for you and maybe I will hide my previous tutorial just to avoid misunderstanding. Alright, so let's go to my computer screen. Alright, so this is my new version. It is 11.7.7 .7. and being mentioned that if you want to upgrade to this latest version, all you need to do is to reinstall the software or you can check for update right inside the software. Uh, at the help tab, okay, for example, you can Go to the help tab right here and then check for update and if it say your Filmora is up to date and it is not Filmora 11.7 you can just reinstall the software and you will get the latest one. Added to that if you want to purchase Filmora license don't forget to use my 20% discount coupon code in the description. Okay so I have special discount coupon code for perpetual plans and also annual plans in the description. Alright so for example uh, let's delete everything on the timeline first. Okay, so I'm going to use a quick text option right here just to add text to the screen and I'm going to change it to text keyframes and I'm going to increase the size of the text also to see, see it better. Okay, so for example now if I want to use the animation keyframe for the text all I need to do is to click here and the keyframing Okay, so just click here to add the first keyframe to the text. By the way, when you add one keyframe to the text, there will be an option right here. So you see here, this is the reset button, meaning that you can delete the keyframe. And you can also read the text right here. Text keyframes can only be adjusted on the parameter panel below, meaning above. Okay, so it's right here. And now you cannot click here on the preview window and adjust the keyframe anymore. Okay, previously you can do that. For example, now if I want to maybe scale up the text right here, all I need to do is to move the playhead to maybe some frame forward like this. And then I'm going to adjust the scale right here. Okay, and it will create two keyframes for us to scale up the text like this. Okay, and now if you want to rotate the text, for example, you want to add another keyframe. For example, here add another keyframe and then move your playhead about four seconds. Uh, I'm sorry, four frame. And now we can adjust the rotation like this. And now we have scale up and rotation. Okay. Very nice, right? And at this position, maybe we want to reset it to normal. We can add another keyframe and then move some frame forward and then reset the rotation. Okay, so this is the animation for the text. Alright, so this is the new way to use animation keyframe for text in Filmora 11.7. And be mentioned that with video and image, you can uh, still adjust the keyframe right here at the preview window. Okay, for example, I have an image here. And uh, let's add an, one keyframe here. And then we can move our playhead to here. And then we can also click at the preview window here to move the image to the right side. For example, it will create another keyframe here. Okay, so it is different from adding keyframe to text like this. Very nice, right? And we can also add another keyframe right here. And then we can move our image. Just click here and move our image to here. Resize it to smaller and move it to this corner. For example, here's a keyframing for an image. Move to right and then move to left, move to the corner. Alright, so this is how you can use animation keyframe for text in Filmora 11. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye!